Hey Cole Mac, we're going to touch sword stance. Okay. So, forwards, backwards, slide to the front. Basket alt, a bit above shoulder height. Elbow in a little bit, forearm forward. Like so this, in the basket. Don't want too far forward, don't want too far back. Don't want to wedge it in, don't want a comfortable spot. Now, the comfortable spot initially is going to feel very weird. See how it's not too far out, not too far in. The point's slightly backwards. I do this, it doesn't matter, you can also do that and that. This one's across there, it's a little bit more defensive to be able to block combined with this, your uh, sword, uh, shield. So from here, as you practice there, you go to the pal, go where your hand is, you learn to step, throw. Now, it might be hard to learn initially, so what I want you doing is figure out what the stance holds your sword, and step, recover. Step, recover. Your sword's there. Make sense? So wherever your hand is, you're going to recover to that one. Now, what I want you doing is, what you're seeing, you feel that position. It's going to feel a little bit strange to begin with, because it always does in regards to it. But that way, from this pain, position, when we do some drills, you'll be able to learn to block with both, both your sword and your shield. Okay, so we're going to do a little bit of shield work next, and then we combine the two.